Akida coined the word tack and learn to become tackland, which is now becoming a viral thing. Tackland Entertainment Maze is your one number one entertainment outfit in Turkana. We sell music, we advocate for music, we lobby for music, we fight for music. That is what Tackland is all about. Nothing else. Pesa Badae, Fem Kwanza. Na if Fem itakam na nini? If you are part of music, Changamuka. Nothing comes on a silver plate. You need to work hard. For your music to sell, Maze Lazimo Uchoche. And the internet to Rapcheza Naya Maze, let it be your playground. Music pays. Mimi Naishi Namziki. Music pays me. Music pays my bills. We do every kind of genre of music. We have reggae artists, we have Zouk Bongo, we have hip hop artists, we have Afro Bengas, we have R&Bs, we have every kind of music. Hakuna music si tumewacha, ukuja tukana music ni kibao, every genre. Iko mbaka wasio na piga rock and roll. Most of them wajaye wasikia, kuna wasio na piga matrap, wala wasio ama mikono, they are there. We have every kind of genre in Tuckland. First thing first, I have to appreciate Northlink Production. These guys have been with us through rough parts. They shoot for us videos. They don't charge us a dime. They, they spend most of their time writing scripts for us, producing our music, shooting our music. Those goes to Northlink. Second, to the artists who have been with us, the likes of Tembe, the likes of Inapet, MC Lion, the likes of Kejo the Cypher, Ibra, Akida, Dafril, yeah, these guys kinda six nine colors, and all the lovely artists of this land. I also have to appreciate uh, the county government, some ministries on a job. The county government of Tukana, we big you up, Ministry of Environment and Tourism, Ministry of Finance, Governor's Office, we appreciate that. We also have to big up the senator of this county, Dr. Ma uh, Professor Malik Ekal. Malik Ekal, not to tackle an entertainment, but to the artist. Alienda ka tutengenezea juzi awards, whereby Trukana Music and Arts Association, which Tackle and Entertainment is a member, we got an award. Some of our artists won, some of our artists participated, and which by we thank them. Then the general public, maze wase wa Turkana, every time we have an event, they always come in big numbers. Trukana people love us, not Tackle and Entertainment alone, but the whole, the artistic industry. Mimi na love, mimi na salute. Always, forever. Big love. Karibu sana. Asante. The last time I checked, you are Dahil. Mm. If I'm not wrong. Yes. Ama ulibalilisha jina. Apana. <laughs> who is uh, Dahil, by the way? Dahil, For those who don't know. Dahil is just this other guy lives in Lodwa, lives everywhere in Tukana, born and raised in Kalakol. Then we moved to Kakuma and then came back to Lodwa. Uh, I love music. I've been promoting music in Tukana for the last, I don't know, 20 years or so, 15. Uh, I'm a parent, I have kids, I'm a husband, I have a wife, and uh, I love this land very, very much. Just simple me. Talking about promoting music, um, you know, like I, I did say in my intro that you are that one man who has made Turkana County to be recognized. Uh, Diamond has been here. Whose work was that? Was it you who has been doing all that? Or someone behind it? Or maybe Takland Entertainment? But before that, let's talk about Takland Entertainment. Takland Entertainment, the word Tak, from, it's just the first word of Turkana. We coined it in 204. Me, Akida, the likes of Ibra, Lobo. To come, uh, let's, let's take the first word to represent us as the Trukanas and then land to represent the land that we are. So we formed Takland. Takland was established in 204, 2004. We were young guys uh, coming into music. At that time, Kenyan industry, the likes of Kina Isa Nani. So we decided to to clear something in Trukana. And story in a promotion, bringing in a diamond. The diamond deal, I chased it with Homeland. There's a time there was a club in town called Homeland. 
we wanted to bring diamond but uh, unfortunately uh, there's another club took him they brought him here so that was uh, I wasn't a part of that deal but uh, the likes of Alikiba, Omi Dimples, Rivani, Harmonize uh, and, and most of these were Safi guys that was that was me and my crew and uh, talking of being recognized globally uh, we are trying I have friends all over the world. I have friends in Nigeria, I have friends in Tanzania, I have friends in Uganda. I have a friend in Germany. Guys who are, who are listening to our music. We have others even as far as states. But uh, being recognized, that is what we are doing. We are trying to reach there. What do you love about Tukana music? Tukana music is rich. Our content is you can compare it with people in Nairobi. Let me let me, let me say that. Since it long here, most of our music, most of our lyrics talk about this land. Talk about the culture. We talk about the hustle we go through. Shida nyetu konazo. So if you listen to Tukana music, the content we give is 100% pure. Haina uti ajimob. We don't diss people. We use pata music yetu tunatukana watu ama tunaongea kuhusu maumbile ya wanawake or anything. Our music is rich and that's why I love it. Suppose you have to change something about the Turkana music, what will you change? Leadership. Every musician, every music industry in the world needs a political jack. The likes of Kina Bobby Wine, if it wasn't for Museveni, Kina Kamilo Nonge kwa mali wako. If it wasn't for Kikwete, President Kikwete in Tanzania, the likes of Kina Diamond, Kina Likiba wange fikapa. If it wasn't for Mike Sonko and Uhuru Kenyatta, Jaguar wouldn't be where he is. If it wasn't for Jay-Z, I mean if it wasn't for Obama, Jay-Z campaigned for Obama and made him who he is now. For us to go, for us to change the whole thing, our political guys need to put us in heart. Politicians are afford to shike. You need a political office for us to move. And when I say that, kuna things come uh, music rights, kufanya when you have public gathering, unapata sometimes in barazas you're not being called, ni sisi tena tuende tuwaombe. So those kind of things, they give us that publicity. But few leaders have done that, few. But I just think mali ni sit nataka. Clubs are being constructed each and every day. What do you think? Uh, the owners of these clubs, are they promoting the local music or...? Um, few. Club owners, few of them wanted to promote. And uh, I'm proudly to say the likes of Rodney. Rodney, the owner of Antidote, gives us space. And at Patiado sometimes calls us, pay us, we perform at his club and people come. Uh, the likes of uh, Shakespeare, owner of Pomaide, Ah, say to promote. But uh, I hope they've seen the outcome of our shows, our events when we when we go to their clubs. Turus wanaja, what wanna come wengi? And uh, if I put it in percentage, eighty percent of them are promoting us. Now I hope newcomers when you talk with the industry, uh, yeah, clubbing nanini, peer to support. But we have to force the force to support if he doesn't like you or if he doesn't want you. So it's a private business. We go there, talk to them. If they like our music, they bring us on board. If they don't like, we have to put off. You were into music sometimes back. Yes. What happened? Uh, I changed career. Nearly switch. I think that was way back in 2001. And industry in Trukana Ikua. So I had to switch. I switched my career from being an active musician into becoming a DJ. So I started doing the DJing thing. Mm -hmm. I did it for like around three, three, four years. I quit. Then switched to another. But music make a part of me all along. Yeah. The promoting thing is well paying you. It's kabisa. Mm -hmm. Kabisa. Mm -hmm. And uh, I'm happy. So far, so good. Um, being in Takland Entertainment, uh, being being a part of the promotion people. Because there are so many guys in Trukana people who are doing promotion. 
Uh, we have other guys who are doing uh, the same thing I'm doing. It's easy to make it. We have a label. Takland has a label. Uh, we, we are doing music. We are promoting music at the same time. We promote uh, what you call cloth line. We have a cloth line. Same thing that I'm wearing. Mm -hmm. uh, and we have other businesses. We do printing, branding and all those things. So being in music just doesn't mean that we're only getting our resources from active clubbing or going to do shows. Nanini. We have the cloth line. We have... Uh, we have we have the studio the thing that ma that money comes in, and uh, now going to clubs. There is this thing called uh, Trukana Gala Gala Night. Uh, Trukana Gala and Expo. Yeah. yeah, let's talk about it. And the thing that made us to when Trukana Gala, and we started this thing in 2012. There is a time Ilifika, and you have music, you have that product, but how na malia ku launch. Mm -hmm. There was, I remember there was only one club in town. And that club, walikuwa naona content enye situ na uza, high value kwao. So mm -hmm. what we did, we had to create uh, a, a, an event that will bring all artists, models, creative arts, or showcase talent yao, and pay them. That was a Takland Entertainment project. And that is what has made so far, you see we have more than more than 300 groups. At that time, we were only having like one or two groups. So easy, we are in total, if you go to offices, he is a gava, or a kwambia, music groups in Trukana are over 300. Look at the model. The model industry, we are the ones who flourished it. Mm -hmm. To an extent, we are talking about account, we are talking their auditions and events. Mm -hmm. They come take from us, these models. So Trukana Gala Night is something that is celebrated uh, most of the youth man when you is it sponsored or you are just self -sponsored? at that time the first six times we've been sponsoring ourselves mm -hmm. then 2017 he got a sponsor ambassador richard mm -hmm. ambassador richard used to have his own event talent after talent mm -hmm. and we were doing the same thing so we merged we decided rather than having two events that does the same thing Mm -hmm. We decided to wake up a model. Yeah. So Ambassador Richard came on board and he's been sponsoring that event. <sighs> if you are to be a fruit, mm. which one will you be? If like I Matunda. Matunda. Eh? Matunda eh? Yeah. Ni Mkoma. <laughs> Kwa nini Mkoma? Na feed watu wangu. Yeah. So watu kanas wanakula wanakula na njaa. Mm -hmm. So me, a part of me wants, kama nige kwa fruit, nige ataka waturua ni kule. Mm -hmm. ah. okay. So, as Dail now, mm -hmm. what do you want to tell the upcoming artists around Trukana County? Mm. Because they are all lying on you. Uh -huh. You are the one who have brought them together mm -hmm. as Takland Entertainment. Mm -hmm. What is your advice to them? My advice is, Ama, my advice will be, wakue, wakue real. Let them be themselves. That's why you imitate genre of music that is being done by other people. Mm -hmm. Uh, if I was to tell them directly in Gawambia, there's so much in Trukana that you can write about. Yeah. Let's talk about Trukana. Let's let's not imitate others. Let's be ourselves. Kama ni music yetu, ata ni mzuri tuimbe in vernacular. So that when somebody points us at a kona jua, hiyo ngoma ni gani, language gani metumika. Na let's... Basically, to watch it to imitate, to watch it example of others. Mm -hmm. Let, let's be us. Now, for these upcoming artists, one of our one thing, e industry is rough. Me, I believe in one thing: look for fame first. There is nothing comes after fame. Ukijulikana, pesa ita come. The problem with our young upcoming artists, somebody may record ngoma leo wants to make money cash. Mm -hmm. Doesn't work out like that. You need to brand yourself. You need to publicize yourself. You need to do everything. <laughs> for your music. So, msia anafaa jue, hii kitu ni jani. See something enye lianza. See, tu lianza 204. Mm -hmm. It's almost 15 years now, na hata tujefika mahali. So, it, unajua aste aste. You have mm -hmm. to look for fame first. Watu wakujue. Mm -hmm. Bada watu kukujua, music will come. Okay. In five years to come, mm. Takla nitakua hapi. Itakua hapa ama? In five years to come, Takla is still the household name in Trukana. Mm -hmm. Na, I don't know, mungu na napanga future. 
but mimi naomba Mungu inshallah in 5 years to come mm -hmm. uh, Nairobi will be coming looking for us things are moving ukiangalia county vile iko in 10 years ago atakuwa na barabara atakuwa na mafida roads mm -hmm. 10 years later we are now 7 years in this devolution thing mm -hmm. uh, 3 quarter of lodo iko tamaked unaona we have these big hotels na nini na nini nobody knew that so 5 years to come maybe si ndo tutakuwa tunashikilia industry ya Kenya 15 good years in industry mm. of being a promoter yes ni gani ambao maifanya yani ume promote kabisa mpaka ikaingiana eh mm. people know akida akida is my chief executive officer and your from Takland na mimi akida has a song it used to be number 5 hit 3 weeks straight i mean 3 to 4 weeks straight in Yen germany Turkana. in germany seriously i'm telling you in I talk, there is a song in I to think about the way. Mm -hmm. It is a, a remastered tape by a guy when called... When was that? That was in 2014. Okay. From 2014 to around 2016, mm -hmm. that song is big in Germany. And I to think about the way, uh, mastered by Akida and DJ Pedro. Mm -hmm. Me, I'm a part of that project. Now, up to now, we are getting 50% rights to your song. Okay. So that means every month Akida gets money. Mm -hmm. That's a project that I did, na Akida na mm -hmm. And on another angle, I have artists that have taken to Nairobi, wame recordiwa, wame shoot your videos, mm -hmm. I've promoted them to an extent where some of them are Julikan. There's a guy called Keijo. Mm -hmm. if, you go to, if you go to Nairobi, ngoma yake na chezo kwa clubs. Mm -hmm. But in Lodo people, wana muangalia ni kama tu is just an ordinary guy. Unona? Mm -hmm. And there's some people that I've worked with, not being in Takland, eh? but yeah. kufanya job na wawo. Mm -hmm. The likes of Bansen. Bansen says, unangalia ako hapi. Ako ju. Mm -hmm. Ibra ako hapi, Ibra ako ju. These are people that I've worked with. And I've helped them in one way or the other. No, no, whether direct or indirect. Mm -hmm. Na I celebrate them. That's why unangalia. If they have something on board, they always call me. And if I have something on board, I call them. Na ni gani umai fanya? Yani ka fail kabisa? Ya ni fanya ka fail? Yangu maybe personal. Mm -hmm. Yangu ili fail. <laughs> I tried I wanted, fail? I wanted to be I wanted to be a musician uh -huh. but it failed. Uh -huh. So that means so, No. Uh -huh. Because ni, when one has that passion mm. towards something you know. Inafanyika. Uh -huh. At that time imagine 2001. Mm -hmm. You are a musician in Turkana. There are no clubs in Lodo. Mm -hmm. Who knows you? So or two or two. Explore somewhere else. I would have explored uh -huh. but sasa unajua mimi interest yangu na hati yangu iko so rather than me being this person that I want, let me go look for something and yet I create brand yangu. That's why I switched to DJing. And when I switched to that, I remember Akida recording his first single in 2004. I brought him on board to like perform. I was in Loki at that time. Then there's this guy, Mwenye Saizi Ako, is doing gospel. At that time, I'll call it Wanga Stabones. Saizia and it was smart music. Mm -hmm. That guy was the, the, the first guy who had an album. Uh, Roger composed in Trukana and everything. We are here, Nikangalia, why should I go for this thing and I can do something to promote these games? Niliamon is quite selfish. You come up with a music. 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 Yeah. Music at Trukana. Inaenda aje. Mm. Music ya Turkana, mm. itafika mahali if all players come on board, stakeholders. Mm -hmm. That is the county government, yeah. the leaders, the club owners, the artists themselves. Kwa sabu kiangalia kama and the public, every time we have an event, it's mm -hmm. sold out. Waturu come wengi, they come to see us performing. The only thing enye natukosa kututuwa, unajua ni makamera atuna. If we had a television like NTVs and those things, mm -hmm. they don't play our music because we are a thousand kilometers away from them. Mm -hmm. So imagine if Turkana was in Eldoret. Mm -hmm. Na Eldoret iko hapa. Si tungekuwa tsha hit. But we have Atakar TV. No? There is Atakar TV which we, <laughs> we, we believe music. <laughs> uh, which we believe itatufikisha <laughs> somewhere. But Atakar TV pia nataka Jacob. Mhm. Mm Unajua to be on the on the truth side. Na get. Mm -hmm. Wale wa say people in Nairobi mm -hmm. msi ana record studio. Anatoka kwa studio, anapeleka ngoma kwa radio. Akipeleka radio, akisha shoot video, akwa na accessibility ya kupeleka kwa TV. Mm -hmm. Sisi tu record ngoma, to shoot video lodwa, mm -hmm. we have to fly 
we have to go by road. Ufike Nairobi uji mtu. Mm. Kitambo peleke hiyo nini wa kuambiwa umetoka lodo. They don't know. Mm -hmm. Hawatutambui. But kama tunge imagine, we imagine our politicians wako kwa nasema. Media stations enye ziko Kenya. Mm -hmm. O enye ziko Nairobi. We By the way, I, I was going to come mm. to that. Mm. There, there was a debate mm. going around, I think <coughs> it was last, last month, mm. about Kenyan uh, radios, mm. they are not playing Kenyan music. True. What's your take on that? Very true. Mimi kwa zata na support you. Sabu napata, there is a time we took Akida's video. Mm -hmm. Tukapeleka, I don't want to name names, eh? mm -hmm. tulipeleka kwa mse flani. Mm -hmm. That was like five years ago. Yeah. I was that guy asked us for something. I told him that he was going to be a good thing. So imagine we are from Lodwa. I was going to say that the video was classic, everything was good. I was going to say that I was going to be a good thing. So if you have content in Kenya, we have to play ourselves. So you know what I'm going to say about Kenya? Yeah, some, some of us so know. You just appreciate him. See you later. But sasa unajua angalia distance. I'm not promoting kidogo. I know. I'm just saying. Eh angalia mahali yenye tunatoka. Na angalia mahali ya wasio wako. Playing Kenyan content wenye ni shida. We have good musicians in Kenya wenye wanafaa kupromote but we promote others. Na wale ukiangalia mimi mimi nakupatia facts. If Diamond comes to Kenya, the first thing he does atatafuta ama media personality au eke box. Umeget? Na hii ni reality. They know. Si ati hakuna mtu ajui. Yeah. William send ya pati 100% airplay. Mm. Azima na jenga wa say. But us, we angalia mali tunatoka. Tunatoka Lodwa. A thousand kilometers away from Nairobi. Everything we do in Nairobi ni garama. Utenda ujenge mse na content yako ni wazimu. So, ni, ni ile tu kujipanga basi. Yeah, no. So, imebidi. <laughs> Unajipanga ukitaka kupeleka ngoma yako, unatenga tu kitu kidogo ya kujenga ya wazimu. But at the end of the day, <laughs> they will give you an airplay of like three days. Mm -hmm. Then what about those other three? But, uh, but at least you have been recognized. At least. Yes, we are being recognized. Uh -huh. And uh, na hiyo ni effort. Uh -huh. Ni wase kujituma. Ndio hiyo sasa. Uh -huh. Lazima ujitume. True. Uh -huh. Na I hope wata wata wata, wata kuwa na kama hapa pia. Uh -huh. Watusikize vizuri and we give them what they want. Content ni kibao tukano. Kibao sana. Uh -huh. Na ukiangaleta radio stations zetu hapa, mina or big up. Our radio stations players, like uh -huh. 60% of their content mostly ni tukana music. That's why ono nata hii radio imetufanya si tujulikani. But radio za Nairobi maze, blanda. <laughs> For my take, hii Tobongore is a good thing. Ina sell tukana. Uh -huh. Kama hata I sell musically, but in a sell the cultural and the tourism aspect of it. Now that is a big platform for us. Mimi naomba the people who are responsible for Tobonglore. Please, mm -hmm. the way you are selling tourism sites and the culture uh, culture ya uh, Turkana, sell the music also. You saw General Edu last year, the last Tobonglore. Alipata one million shillings the deputy president gave him. And it's through Tobonglore. Yeah. So that means... If they give us that platform again, which means there is another millionaire coming also on board, maybe this year ni nanokula tatupatia yo one million. So for me, to Bangalore is good. My parting shot is love Turkana, sell Turkana, live for Turkana, do everything for Turkana. There is no any other place in this world peaceful and the most loving people come at Turkana. And I thank you at Akir TV for taking me through this journey ya kuambia wase, my hustle, my story. Eh, uh, lovely Deborah here. Thank you for interviewing me. Kama kawa kama da. Taklan Entertainment. We e e e boom. Karibu sana next time. Alagara. <laughs>